Hello everyone, welcome to Building the Ultimate Matchbox Car Collection. My name is Tyrone. I've just thought of a very funny story. I'll tell you as we go through this. Ah, I amuse myself. National Parks is back with an automated electric van. MBX self-driving bus. Hmm. Oh, the other MBX ones are the service truck and the road roller. Is that true? Hmm. And what else we got? Mercedes AMG SL63 Audi 2019 Audi TT RS Coupe Toyota and the 84 MR2 1969 Camaro SS396 from General Motors and Citroen Amy. Amy. There is the back. I'm trying so hard not to give myself the giggles. There's the artwork. It's okay. The casting's okay. We've got to have it because it's in the national parks. And I'll flood the table with national parks stuff as we go. In a further attempt to make this video interesting. <laughs> because the self-driving, what do they call it? Yeah, self-driving bus isn't my thing. But I've got plenty of them. I'll show you them all. You'll see everything by the end of this show, I promise. So my funny story is I zip through, or as I empty out the very loud packaging of its contents, it pertains to national parks, just to keep it in keeping, which is why I was reminded of it. My friend isn't um, happy to come out of the box. Gee whiz, they packed him in. Oh, loud things. Sorry about that. All right, we'll, we'll whiz through the, the B-sides with the road roller. So the story I thought of was when I was at, Gra at the Grand Canyon over a decade ago now, but I'll never forget it. It was lovely. They had uh, snow overnight, a lot of snow. It wasn't snowing when I was there. Well, it was a little bit, but it wasn't a feature of the day. The snow on the ground was because it was really thick in some places. Deep, not thick. Um, as we look at the 1965 it's Ford C900. You've seen it before. You've seen all of these before. Should we go down a little? Coming down. There you go. That's better. No need to crane your neck, son. Citroen in the ME. Um, so Grand Canyon, I was so thrilled because it, it was winter in the States, but you know, in the South it doesn't do anything unlike, uh, it, it doesn't do anything different to what it does here in Perth, Western Australia in the winter. Nothing much happens in the winter. No snow, no nothing. So imagine my uh, surprise and enthusiasm when it was very snowy at the Grand Canyon. So I took to making snowballs and throwing them over the edge into the abyss. 1969 Camaro SS 396 in brown with black interior. And a pizza for the driver. And my wife was saying, oh, grow up. And I said, no, no, no. Get, get a photo of me hurling the biggest snowball, <laughs> snowball I could make into the abyss of the Grand Canyon. Wouldn't that be a fabu fabulous photo? She was, eh, all right. So she did it. it. Took about five takes. So a lot of snow went over the edge, let me tell you. Anywho, the bus, we get on the little bus, and it wasn't one of these self-drivers. It was, um, I got a 22-seater or whatever, a free service. You can go from one ledge to the other, I can't remember, something like that anyway. One lookout point to the other. So we got on the bus and oh, this um, MR2 is lights down right hand drive by the way. I've finally got those randomly, but anyway. Audi TT RS Coupe. Stunner. And another stunner is the AMG. 
what a beauty almost silver interior but we'll call it grey looks cool the start of the show is the National Park's self-driving bus with trees in the windows and now I'll flood the table firstly I'll, I'll get out the other ones I have of it I thought I had like a thousand of them because they always turn up in nine packs don't they that might be the original and then this one and this one. I'll show them together because I always get them confused if they're alone. Then you put them together and of course they're different. Right, so that's the the show. Except for the long-winded story I'm about to launch into. Um, so the bus stops and the the lady, the driver, the actual human, not like in these things, turn around to the small group of people randomly scattered throughout the 22 seater with a face on her like she was going to stab one of us and she said uh, we've had reports of somebody throwing snowballs over the edge of the canyon I'm like oh no and I was about to say sorry my bad cuff me but she goes oh, um, some dudes on the back row beat me to it and they, oh, that was us. Sorry, miss. And she just launched into them about how you can kill someone with a snowball because it's a kilometre deep or a mile deep, whatever. And I, I just, oh, fools. Who would do that? <laughs> Total covered. Totally covered. <laughs> they took the fall. I mean, it's not like they weren't doing it themselves, apparently. Lake Patrol on. <laughs> on this one. <laughs> um, notice the shields. Um, some have trees, some have wolves, some have the bear. Um, there's all sorts going on. And I'll quickly go through because there's so many of these. There's the bear. There's a bear in there. Um, many, many times I've done a video and um, <laughs> uh, whatever I'm showing the variants of miss out because they're in my national parks drawer. This one's missed out a few times. Poor thing. I think so is this over the years. National parks. Is that the coronet? Yeah. 59 Dodge Coronet Police, but in national parks. I like that one. It's not really in keeping, but I like it. The Bush fire truck. Chevy Blazer. I think he's missed out on a few showings. And I was showing all my Chevy Blazers off, and this one was crying in the drawer. The Ram. Speaking of Rams, they really did a number on this National Parks one for the Mattel Creations Collectors Series. Not too long ago now. Really pushed the boat out on that one, didn't they? Rubber tires, the whole shebang. And the plow. What did they call this one? Just maintenance truck, wasn't it? A couple of castings there. Plough moves, plough doesn't move. You know the drill. A couple of uh, little camping trailers. Same but different. Both national parks. And the backhoe. That's come out recently in INC now. And also MBX construction. So, where do you put it in your collection? It's a dilemma, isn't it? Always will be some randos. Is that the quest? No. Oh, quest or quest. Speaking of snow, imagine living in a place where you need one of these. Hail cat. That's right. Another player for the road maintenance park ranger. Thing. Um, not to be confused with actual park rangers, they do a load of these too, but they're not part of it. Put those over there. They're very complicated. This comes off, doesn't it? I think I, um, I yanked it off one or another. Yeah, there you go. Slightly less complicated without it, but you know. 
they never set right after you take them off the first time. Actually, this one has. That's good. What's that? The F350 Super Duty. And mm, I think this is another one that's missed the, the Limelight Jeep Cherokee. Maybe I should split them all up into the yeah, castings rather than the national parks. Garbage King, Waste Services, a horse float for the Equestrian Ranger. Middle base on that one. Really crowding out the ones I'm actually showing you today. And the little post hole digger road crew. Sweet. Let's go uptown, do a bit of a pan around. I kind of think I wazed up that uh, nine pack. When I find it entertaining, I think there's a better chance of you finding it entertaining. Brilliant. So that's the 2024 Matchbox 9 pack featuring the self drive bus. I always forget its name, <laughs> it's so forgettable. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed my silly story, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Come back soon. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.